Hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for watching. I know it's been a minute. It's actually been longer than that. It's winter. It's uh, gloomy and and it's just cold and stuff like that. We got some big changes coming to the channel. I'm going to let you guys know about that in about a week or so. I gave you a little short hint, a little teaser. More about that soon to come. But you know what? It's like I said, it's winter time. It's my neighbor's backing up. Hopefully it doesn't hit me. Um, it's cold. We're just trying to stay warm. We're trying to stay as efficient as we can in our Teslas. Trying to get all the miles and kilometers as we can with the best efficiency. And at the same time, trying to stay comfortable and warm. We're not one of these people that uh, put electric blankets or, or drive with a blanket and turn down the climate control just because it's cold and just because, you know, we want better efficiency to get those extra five or 10 miles out of your car. No, no, we're not about that. We bought a Tesla, so we want to be comfortable. So let me show you, and I did a video about this before, but uh, probably a few years ago, but it's gotten a lot better since. So let me show you how you can get some good efficiency with just a little bit of money spent and probably 10 or 15 minutes of your time. Okay, folks, welcome back. The company I'm talking about is a company called evinsulate.com. It's a Canadian company. That's why I like to support it. Anything Canadian, um, I mean, from anywhere, but if it's Canadian, it's, you know, it's homegrown and I like to support as much as I can. You, it's, it's installed in this car. You may be able to see it. You may not be able to. It's pretty well hidden. Uh, it doesn't change much of the ish, if any of the aesthetics of the car, but it's amazing what it does. This is called EV glass and it's right above me here on this is the Model Y. So it's one piece. The only thing you can maybe see is this little bar right here. This is how it looks now. How it used to look when it first came out was a lot different. Uh, I have a video where I think I showed you where it was on my Model 3 it was just foam and that worked good. This works a lot better. Keeps the aesthetics of the car incredibly the same. It, like I mean you if I didn't tell you about it you probably would not have noticed it. So let me show you how easy this is to install and the benefits. Okay, folks, so I'm in the back seat here and I'm just going to pan up and show you this uh, piece of glass here. Now, what it is, it's actually polycarbonate and what it is is one piece on the Model 3. I think it's two pieces, but on the Model Y, it's just one big piece. And what it does, it's a layer. It's a, bo it's a layer that uh, fits in between the top glass and, and the interior. And what it does, it keeps the heat in when you heat up the cabin in the winter time and it actually works believe it or not it actually works in the summertime too to keep the cool in and keep the heat out so it's dual purpose it's not just for this for the winter time so you don't have to take this out come springtime as, as the temperatures start warming up leave it in all year round as you can see it's almost seamless like i said only this one little bar is the thing that shows uh the the benefits are incredible i've been using this for about two or three weeks now and i can tell you usually my temperature that i Keep in here is usually about 21 and a half degrees, anywhere from 21 to 21 and a half degrees Celsius. Now I'm keeping it at, at least one degree cooler at about 20 because it doesn't take that much energy to heat up the cabin. And when it does heat up, it keeps the heat in really amazingly. And let me just show you, uh, they're little clips, the little plastic urethane clips that go in and it just goes right under the headliner here. I'll show you a quick little install video of how it was when it was installed when the owner and developer of EV Insulet, Paul Hindle, he came and he installed it for me. But you can do it yourself, it's super easy. It's obviously a lot easier with two people, but you know, it's got to be able to be done with one for you. Yeah. If you only have one person, Someone with a good uh, wingspan. from um, the 
other one. And now these work in, in summer or winter, right? Yeah, I actually sold quite a few into the states, like California and Texas and things, just from uh, the uh, uh, keeping the heat in the car. Yeah, because I think it wasn't when you first, um, I, correct me if I'm wrong, when you first uh, had the original one, was it not just to, for maintaining heat in the cabin so the HVAC wouldn't work as hard? Yeah. And then I guess just as a byproduct, you realize it worked just as well in the summer for cooling? That's basically it. Yeah. And uh... So this is it. This is EV insulate. This is called the EV glass. They make it for the Model 3 and the Model Y, as you can see here. They tested it and they found a 24% reduction in range loss at minus 10, which is about 14 Fahrenheit. And of course, the colder it is outside, the greater reduction in range loss. I'll put a, a link down in the description down below. Like I said, this isn't just for wintertime. Paul's got a lot of clients and people that he sold this to that are, live down south in the US uh, in hot, arid climates just to keep the sun out. And uh, it makes a big difference. Anyways, folks, that is it. Check out the link down in the description below. EV Insulate, it makes a huge world of difference. But you don't have to take my word for it, folks. Go to the website, check it out, and make a decision for yourself. And we'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.